G'day, today we're going to play some All Quiet Roads 47-43 uh, and we've got a new level here of Tokyo so let's have a look to see how we do with this one. Alright, we'll start off with fast forwarding things. A few more unique ones that we're starting with there and it looks like we're getting straight away into uh, just freeways, nothing else. Well, oh. I don't really want to have everyone passing through uh, the stadium, but we are very early days. It's nice to just sort of smash through this very early part, though. Very much appreciate the fast forward. That is a long way away. Just pause for a second. Get those two to connect. Let's um, get this guy to come down. Very dramatic declarations of those characters. That must be new too. Um, so. Well, we're going to have to get this guy across. We've only got nine bridges, so it does feel like we're going to have to go across this way. The problem is it means that to get to circles, everyone's going to have to pass through that same one way. A very... Uh, Questionable layout we've got going so far. Assume that that's the new announcement to let you know when you don't have something connected, which I do quite like. Alright, so let's... Make this our first little. Um, now we're gonna have to re remove that and just shift it slightly. So let's put it a bit more here. Bring around the back for that guy. We can then use this edge for that, and then we've got sort of an option, I guess, to. Up past that guy and down like that. Make that the clover leaf. We can finally get to some just normal road. we're starting to see here is that we do have multiple um, multiples of almost everything uh, except the airport I think so firstly this is something that I do need to um, lost my outline of this guy um, I have that guy this um Something that, that I haven't paid attention to is that uh, people have pointed out that there's the no through traffic options of um, this button. And all of my other videos are sort of bulk made before I went on a holiday. So um, I did get to read comments for almost every week saying like, oh, you can stop stuff going through things by just using that don't pass through option. All right. Um, so this guy here... Let's give him... How many bridges have we got? We run him... Up this way. Um, we then have 
So there's seven different things. We have everything but a hospital connected to this. So what we can do is get rid of this connection and that connection and run that through there. So what that actually means is that this side here is now self-sufficient. Um, get rid of that. Let's bring this guy down. Like that. Circles. Circles is the only other thing that's not currently on that setup. Something that we have very, normally very commonly. So as soon as I got rid of this guy, it got replaced. So what we need is we basically need a connection that runs um, this circle. All right, great. So, uh, on this side, let's since the hexagons are the the common one, let's run the the hexagon out the back of the circle. Let's try and straighten this up a little bit more. All right, so now everything on that side is um, represented. So <sighs> always hate it when someone just has to ruin the fun. This means we've just. Gotta shift it all, I guess, slightly to the side. Clover leaves, leaves. We've just got to wait for these things to clear out now. And there, this guy can now run a bit more direct this way. Give him the clover leaf. <laughs> and we now need to sort of just fix up what we've got going on on this side. So there's no real good spot with the, the setup of this side of, I guess, somewhere to have some nice um, intersections. Let's clean this out a bit. Let's go um, just here. I feel like we're going to be able to sneak all of those edges out anyway. And then what we want to do is we want to say this guy, no through traffic. Yeah, those two 
points there are basically stranded inside. Actually, no, what we need to do then is have this sort of land in there. Um, but we can just shift these around, I'd say. So that can go there. This can go there. And then we can leave those two as our open ones. Uh, we'll make that an intersection. Then... Did that get added all the way up there? All right. Well, that does really expand the north, and I guess give us an answer of what we can connect onto onto that. These guys that way. Cloverleaf in there. That's a circle already on the circle route, so let's clear all of that and just wait for that to come back. We also just need to make that connection to Allow these guys to pass through while we're building here. Alright, getting a bit circle heavy down the bottom now. I don't want that connection in there either, so let's... This circle I don't really know where to put because we don't want him also running into the back of um, our other guy. Maybe what we need to do with him is have him just sort of cut across like this. Now this is very short term because it's under the assumption that we're not going to get more cities down the bottom or more towns down the bottom. Like so. So what we'll do is we will put this triangle on the back of that guy. the point where I sort of feel like I'm getting more um, more problems and I'm getting sort of pieces to use as solutions but that just more means that in the way that more pieces in the way that I want to solve my these problems there's not a triangle ah. triangle just means that everything coming through is going to get sent through that guy its own little hub down the bottom here, which is a problem. almost where I sort of find my biggest struggles in this game is that I've I've mapped out a way that I think it should work and then that strategy that layout stops sort of like 
or gets overwhelmed and I just can't see the fix. to add this guy. What was that new one? I heard him, but I wasn't looking. A lot of circles on this side now. Ah, okay. Way out in the sticks. Don't even have enough road to, to get anywhere near him. Oh, maybe. This is where I now need a traumatic overhaul in the layout that I've got, but I also just don't have the pieces to um, do the layout, the overhaul. Really what I need to be doing is just cutting some of these longer routes, but I mean, say like connecting this guy anywhere on this side would make him in such a worse position. Yeah, I know he's not connected, I know. Well, at least it's not a circle. He's a pain though. Keep coming. I mean, I almost have to go into the road swapping and um, start doing requests for like to trade all of my um, highways that I started with and just trade it in for single roads. I do appreciate the new uh, focus in on a um, on a new destination. Ah, oh, just keep coming. Maybe this is just how out of step I am. I think with uh, how long it's been since I played. Get off my roads. Oh, I mean, the guy to this left, to his left, has already got two triangles on him. The guy to his right's already got a triangle on him. I mean, what I might have to do is cut this, run that straight down, and then use this, I guess. This so direly needs to be set up as its own intersection. Just don't have the road. At 
Please be something other than a square. Triangle, thank you. See the backlog already starting to go through the square. This is going to be a disaster down here. So I can't trade for demolitions at all. A lot of currency for uh, for trucks though. Let's make that faster, because it seems like that's getting used. This intersection's already filled up. I haven't even built it yet. But, well, firstly, let's not sit on these um, clover leaves that I've already got. Might as well use them if we've got them. Should have enough road now as well that we can that's connected properly. That's okay. That puts a circle much closer to this section than it previously had. thinking about as well the the way that you want to use um, highways like something like this road here we know no one is going to be heading north on it um, well, barely anyone's going to be heading north on it so it being fast into that intersection isn't going to jam that intersection it's it's going to actually help the intersection because it's always going to be taking more things than it um, and it gives so if you were putting, like, say, these three circles, if they all had expressways, this guy as well, he probably shouldn't have one, um, it means that there's going to be just traffic getting into that intersection quicker. And is that, a, is that efficient or is that inefficient? We're going to set ourselves up for disaster. Okay, we're starting to get to a point where we can now look to redesign a bit. Now, redesign point number one is definitely going to be down here. Now, the tricky thing is, we want an intersection down here. But we also want these guys to have immediate access to a square. So never fix that. So these guys have just been sort of bouncing all over the place down here. All right. So let's put an intersection down here. Ugh. Give him a connection. Give him a connection. Break those guys off. a connection um, break that guy off there now the tricky thing is that we don't want too many we, we don't want to remove these guys from having access to things that they need like you can see how many circles are now going to head through um, this intersection And that's a bad thing. In fact, what we've done is essentially made us a, a worse setup than what it had. Let's um, 
keep these two guys connected like that. Get him to move further under. Him to move further under. Needs to go to him, and then this needs to go up. Connect up there. So then the new rule has to be that we want no through traffic on that guy. Put this there. We'll get him disconnected from there and run him up to that guy and then sort of he'll just come back and get this guy to go up and connect there. This can then make the direct connection between the two of those. And we've got to wait for that to disappear. Is that way. And we'll run these guys through there. Now the problem is that it means that everything that isn't a square, triangle, or circle has to now head up through this one route. So that's not good about this setup. I currently don't have a better answer. Alright, we've hit our 4743, so we're now just on target. Our aim is for the 10,000. This poor top side has never been addressed as a, an actual decent setup. Alright. What do I need to spend for bridges? Some expensive bridges. And discourage people from going through those two triangles. Encourage them to go around it. What we actually also want to do is try and encourage guys to bounce straight across to here. Because they don't need the... There's very little required from that. You can see how much traffic is moving through that line too. It's still very early days and there's very clear problems in the setup. May as well reward those that are Heading out this way. Yeah, you can see how much traffic is now hitting this.
from time to time, it actually has calmed down a fair bit there. Got one bridge. Get a little bit more. Let's up our bridges tiny amount. Let's do this. Um And say no pass through on that. And it means that bridge, uh, squares don't have to go up and around. We're allowed to just be passed through here. dependence on this though all these guys up here but all of the guys up here are connecting to basically the thing that has everything connected to it it's almost like all of these guys here are the ones that are having to like consolidate down to a point where they make it to here this is really handy though this uh no through roads I mean, all we're doing is now is just making road. Like we're we're out the other side. We're not getting any more. Um, not getting more any more destinations or anything. So, th and I've now got 105 roads. So this is really where I should be able to go. All right, well, let's make some changes. This guy here feels like the real buckle point. It's it's probably only lucky that he's got such a long road that runs away from him that he's not. In fact, yeah, you can probably see it is here that's going to be the problem. What if we went... How many have we got? We got one. We've only got one bridge. So let's take the, the more bridge option. Coming up on our 10,000 marker. What if I just tried for, say, smaller... Um, smaller sections? And this is just trying to take advantage of... Um, Uh, no pass-throughs. So if we now say no pass-through that, what it now means is that people can just bounce down this way. So if you need to get to this guy, just come this way as opposed to going up through the top. Now it'd be nice to do that for the hospital too, but the hospital um, has stuff coming through the back of it, so we can't really ask the hospital to not be a pass-through point, unless we try to consolidate all of this down, we should consider anyway. At the moment, this side of of the setup is doing quite well. You're not you're not a problem. It's this side that's the um, potential problem. But this is working nicely. I'm a big fan of this. You can start to see this is starting to... He's, he's not coping. It would be neat to build a bridge that just ran all the way from here to down here. I mean... Why don't we? You can see that whole... Uh, 
Um, low is starting to suffer with guys trying to get to the square. This guy's going to start to struggle because of that too, because he's not going to be able to get guys out. It seems very expensive to try and get bridges though, because it's going to cost me... Five of those is only going to get me two of those, and two of those is only going to get me... Very expensive venture. Alright, so what's coming along here? It is both the... Both of these guys. So can we actually get them... To run on from here? Firstly, we've got... Now, we've got a free spot there, but we'd have to use sort of more bridges to, to get over. Let's start spending. I mean, better off using it than sitting on it. Alright, let's see what we can do with 13. as much of that island as possible. I trade trucks. I can trade trucks, but I can't trade trucks for... Um, bridges. The one thing I need. So close. All right. So right here. You can at least see something going that way, so... Well, I mean, I've disconnected them, so that'll, that'll definitely do it. Hmm. Now, the thing is that we do want them to still have a connection going this way, because we do want them to take things that are going to the, the hospital or to the airport out this way. This is a huge line of stuff that's about to hit the dead center of this um, setup. But it has reduced the traffic on this line, so... So what you're hearing now is a sound of consequence. Um, I don't have any more bridges. A bridge... A bridge that could get us there would be great. You can see the hospital traffic is now going to go out that way. Now this is sort of cleaned up a bit. Yeah, we'll take it. I already have one.
wanna join in there. Alright, let's um I need the bridges, that's what I'm missing. It's cursed bridges. Two. Right, well, give me some. Let's claim some highway back from some people that probably don't need it as badly. We need bridges. Or as badly as I think I need bridges. We also need to make this a highway because these guys are um, sending their. Uh, they're seeing that the the route that's um, motorways. I run out, so I started rebuilding it with. Yeah, that's a, I'm on a disaster in here. Now, possibly, I was just like, do I fix this by getting rid of this um, this connection? And if I had bridges, I could. Real log jam going on up here too. It's, um, you can actually see the circles are heading up to this guy too. So let's um disconnect him. I don't know. Let's just connect him on there for now. Select on him. It's right click. What am I doing wrong? There we go. I oh, just hover. That's right. Been that long. I don't want to blow him up. Oh, cool. You can see there's also like the red circle around him showing his uh his impending doom. Also, while this has all been going on, this guy down the bottom has absolutely collapsed. The efficiency that, or the inefficiencies at the top, actually almost pale in comparison to the nightmare that's going on down the bottom now. Ah, well, we had a good run, right? What I think we need to do is try and get more guys connected to the south. Um, and what we'll do, get this 20,000 marker. Let's run that down there. So now you can get to the airport through to the bottom. I don't think there's any fix, fix for what's going on down here. Um, at best we can just like demolish one of these guys. Separate these two guys out so that he gets that one. He gets that one, but I think it's probably too late for them. So I'm not seeing enough um, motorways movement down here. I 
I mean, these guys are all sort of so gridlocked that it's unlikely they're going to quickly pivot to make this change. You can see they're not moving at all. I do feel like looking at this that my layout here has reached its maximum thing. Look at that, the the airport alone almost has, has sent this much traffic that isn't getting addressed. That makes me feel like you would have to have some extreme models of efficiency to really be pushing beyond here. Something that I, I certainly don't have at this point. Anyway, there we go. Almost 18,000. Thank you are. It's me in 25. Any uh, questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. Until next time, catch you later. See ya.